I wish there was something we could do for her. Bring your sister back from the dead. We have an expected high of 108. He's burning up. Lord help us. We need ice. There's a convenience store for our party. Get down, get down. Open the register. Nobody moves unless you want to die. All right, so here's what's going down in Grey's Anatomy Season 21, Episode 8. Y'all better buckle up, because this one's got some serious heat, literally and figuratively. So picture this. It's a blazing hot day, and Grey Sloan's practically a madhouse. The crew's totally swamped, and people are just pouring in with all kinds of heat-related issues. You got folks passing out, patients hitting record-high fevers, and the doctors are scrambling to keep everyone stable. And of course, they're running low on supplies, like it couldn't get worse, right? Now, Amelia and Winston, oh, they're in the middle of this gnarly surgery. I'm talking about one of those make or break moments where you know it's all or nothing. Meanwhile, Joe and Lucas, they get sent out on a little hospital errand and you're thinking, okay, just a quick trip, right? Nah, man, these two end up in the middle of a convenience store heist. I'm telling you, it goes from zero to 100 real fast. People are ducking down, cash registers getting opened, and you're just there like, are they really about to get out of this? And let's not forget the emotional side. Mika's still dealing with her sister Chloe's passing, and everyone's feeling helpless like, man, if only there was something we could do. So it's not just the heat. There's this weight of loss hanging in the air, making everything feel 10 times heavier. But what do y'all think? Do you think Mika's gonna be okay? And what's up with Joe and Lucas? Are they about to have the worst day ever, or will they somehow pull through? Drop your thoughts below, 